what to do Leo here so today I'm by myself but you're gonna be joining me hopefully and watching this spider isekai which has been blowing up recently I found it super enjoyable I have watched it up till now I've caught up and I've been watching it in my own time but I wanted to watch this one specifically today and record it and maybe in the future the future episodes I'll also watch I'll be watching definitely, but I'll record them too. But um, let's just get into this one. So her proficiency based skill level up bonus acquired. She got offense 2000, defense 2000, magic 12,000. Recovery, HUD of occultism. Is there anything new here? Status condition, super enhancement. All these seem pretty normal. I might be missing things. If I do, please let me know. But everything seems legit. Destruction, impact, cutting, piercing, faint, fear, heresy nullification, pain nullification, suffering, super mitigation. That sounds new. Five senses, super enhancement. I think she had that. An instant body. I think she had that. <laughs> did that. Did their clothes come with the evolution? Wait, what? Immortality. Immortality? <laughs> oh, shoot. Yes, it is immortality. Wow. I explained it. Is it? So this is you can no longer do. Yes, she's OP. OP, our spider girl is OP. GG. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. D that means her one, her skill where she had like one HP, she can survive with one HP as long as she has mana. It's completely useless now if she's immortal. <laughs> Is... Oh, wait, okay. Merciless, monster slaughterer. She's been doing that for ages. I don't know how she got that just now. Monster calamity. Ooh. Champion, champion. Why does champion look familiar? Uh, how's okay. Upon obtain skills, destruction enhancement, status condition resistance, be recognized as a champion. Upon visual contact, inflict the fear effect on others, a title bestowed on those worthy of being called champions. <laughs> okay. Wait, is that D? It's D. Yep. I might. Who knows? I might do a cover of this. But in my opinion. Uh, the second one suits my voice funnily, funnily enough. However, I do like the first one a little bit better. But both are fire. So let's just be honest here. <laughs> hey. The CG, the more I watch it, the more I just got used to it. And I've learned to like CG a little bit. In terms of like its ability to show different angles that anime might not be able to do since it's 2D, typically. The fight scenes are definitely something else, especially with Spider, with Kumoko. The styles in which they fight. <laughs> the angles they can take, the shots they can do, the strategy they can even implement are a little bit different. This part was a little bit of a spoiler though, see this? Confirmed Demon Lord is not Kumoko. Confirmed. Maybe they're just messing with us. Who knows? Hmm. They're slain. <laughs> <laughs> a spider destruct button 
<laughs> Yellow. Oh, whoa, that's even scarier. Like, I don't even need a button. I can just... Dead. <laughs> you found immortality. That one managed to evolve. She's one of a kind. Okay, cool. There's no other Zana Horowas in the world. Oh, we're finally getting the details. Wow. <laughs> Look at the halo. <laughs> Dead Wakaba. <laughs> I need to let them escape the boundary. Mm. Okay. So two powerful people. Their attacks were so powerful, it escaped their own reality and somehow only hit the classroom. That's rough. <sighs> <laughs> what do they care of the world I'm just an outsider wait what wait 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 I'm just gonna run that by real quick so there's regular okay so so the regular administrators are the ones who are supposed to actually take care of the world so she's that's not what D is who's D and where are the regular administrators oh my gosh okay I'm just an outsider who proposed the system so she proposed the system I need to, uh, we need more context into what system she's talking about. Hmm. 25 people lost in the explosion that hit the classroom. They collected their souls, left their memories intact. Okay. Isekai, yeah. I provided a special kit. Ooh, the end percentage. I was thinking what that was. As a race that best suited their soul's frequency. Well, some someone was a vampire, but then the other person was a dragon, fey. <laughs> they're really gonna reference this <laughs> if you know you know I didn't re reincarnate. Oh, okay. Wait, so Administrator D is a classmate too? What? Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I'm not even going to comment. That kind of makes no sense, but at the same time it does. So I'm going to just leave it.
Was it the church? Oh no. <laughs> Sounds like fate. To be completely honest with you guys, I don't mess with the human side at all. I don't I'm not really interested. However, I'm I'm hoping that it gets better. Right now I couldn't give a rat's butt. But I love spider. So at least her side of the story. And the demons. So humans I can give a rat's butt again, but maybe it'll get better. Who knows? He sounds like he's being <laughs> like, he sounds like he sounds sus. <laughs> Uh, he's protecting his family. That's, that's a normal reason to not help. Oh, this guy don't give a damn. <laughs> Mustache man don't care. <laughs> Are they going to talk about are they going to talk about like some important stuff? Like maybe in terms of the demon? Who know? Maybe she remembered she learned something when she was evolving as a dragon. Mm -hmm. Many possibilities. Hmm. Everyone but Shun can go. Everyone but the hero. <laughs> that was... Wait, was that Faye? Oh, she got a humanoid form, huh? She got a humanoid form. Human humanification, humanification. That's a. 
a handful of a word. <laughs> Humanification. Mm, Katya probably identifies as a girl anyway. <coughs> really? What does she look like before? It's been a while since we've seen her human version. Ah, oh. I knew that. <laughs> Shalane just looks like Shalane. He just looks like the same dude. Plain, ordinary, blue haired. I don't know who these guys are. I don't know who that is. Oh, Wakaba. That's our spider girl. All right, is there any is there any other people oh I was gonna pause there never mind she can't say Sophia's the vampire right I need to that's a hard no at least I'm thinking it's a hard no from the OP. Uh, of course, we get a beach episode. So they're swimming to the labyrinth. Okay. Wait, is she walking away? What? <laughs> she is scared of dragons. What? What is it? She is a dragon. Why is she scared of water dragons? Ah, never mind. She can't swim. Oh, is there like a... Are they hinting that Faye has a little something-something for our Shleen boy? Oof, water dragon. I wonder if any of them can actually fight a water dragon. Besides Faye. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Shlane. What? Shlane can fight a water dragon? Wait, what? What the freak was that? What? What the? Okay. Sure, sure. <laughs> Swim for your life, hey! Swim for your life!
Wait, she can do the dragon blast from her humanoid form? Well, that's pretty cool. I'll give it that. Oh, that was pretty cool. Mm. I think she caught the feels. Hey, we're at the good part again. There we go. Back to spider. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Wait, what? Weren't you a neat? Oh, okay, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Did she make herself a little a web boat? That's cute. <laughs> How are you going to deal with that puppet spider? That puppet spider looked cool. How much do you bet it's a water dragon, people? Water. Yep, I know it. <laughs> what just one shot it She really is like OP OP. Oh wow, we're going right into it. Water. She teleported the water, okay. You're immortal, right? You're fine. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and immortal, yes. Oh, that took it down. Okay, so are we going to check what's inside the little spider from last episode? <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> Ooh, Perlo Mind. Is it mother? Mother's coming. We were wrong all along. We thought mother was the top of the food chain, but we were wrong? Wait. Who? Top of mother? Who the heck could be top of mother? Wasn't she the strongest one in the labyrinth? Who the hell? <gasps> the demon lord! It's the demon lord! Origin... What the... Whoa, 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 Okay, 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 we must pause, we must pause. Give me a second, people. Prisa blocked. Where's the... 
Origin Tire Attack Level 139 Aerial. Boom. Confirmation. Wakaba is not the Demon Lord. Our Spider Girl is not the Demon Lord. I freaking knew it. All right. What are these stats? <laughs> 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, What are these? Ultra fast recovery. Max, max, max. I'm guessing it's max. Uh, confirm it, max. Uh, ultra fast, max, max. Stronghold, max. Super enhancement, max. I'm guessing 10 is max. So piercing super enhancement, not max. Shock super enhancement, level 10. 10. Battle divinity. Summoning. You can summon. Energy confirmment. Ability confirmment. Energy super attack. Divine dragon power. She's fought dragons. Divine dragon barrier. Okay. Deadly poison. That's what our spider girl has. Paralysis. Paralysis super attack. Yep. Poison synthesis. Medicine synthesis. Sorry, genus. So I'm guessing since she's the Tara Tech, you know. Uh, she's the origin or whatever the whatever her title was again she has all the similar skills to our spider girl dimensional maneuvering cooperation tactician far talk what is that kin control just like mother kin control egg laying silence concentration evasion thought super acceleration future sight parallel minds level four huh i guess four is the max Okay, cool. Hit level 10, Emperor, Appraisal level 10, Probability, Super Correction, Concealment, Fire Magic, Odorless. Oh, she's not level 10, Fire Magic. Sublimation, Heresy Magic, Water Magic, Flood Magic level 5, Gale Magic, Tempest Magic, Earth Magic, Terrain Magic, Seismic, Lightning, Bolt, Light, Holy, Shadow, Sanctum, Dark Magic, Black Magic, Poison Magic, Healing Magic, Spatial Magic level 2. Okay. Skanda. Hey. That was from this episode. Abyss Magic, Great Demon Lord. Great Demon Lord. Level 10. Okay. Dignity. Rage level 9. She's not fully pissed because it would have been 10. <laughs> Gluttony. Usurp. Rest. Depraved. Physical nullification. Flame resistance. Shield nullification. Bolt nullification. Also, big ups to the sub, the subbing team. Whoever subs this, whoever you are or whatever team or group you are, thank you so much for your hard work in this anime. Sincerely. Rot super resistance, fate nullification, fear nullification, heresy super resistance, pain detection, divinity expansion, ultimate life, night vision, clairvoyance, five sense super enhancement, ultimate magic, ultimate movement, fortune, perception, taboo level 10. She knows the secrets of the world. Of course she does. She's the origin tire tech. Gosh dang it. Fortitude, de deva, de deva, diva, deva. She has no skill points. She's maxed out the whole way, I'm guessing. Not really, because level 100 and something, something, right? And she's slightly damaged if we look up. No, she's not. Never mind. It's 87k. I'm looking at the top left in her MP. It's 87,655 plus 99999, just to make sure. And, and titles are Human Slayer, Human Slaughter, Human Calamity. Hates humans. Demon Slayer, Demon Slaughter, Demon Calamity. Okay, she's fair. She kills everything. Fairy Slayer, Fairy Slaughter, Fair Calamity. Monster Slayer and Calamity, Worm Slayer, Slaughter Calamity, Dragon Slayer. She just kills everything and anything, to be honest. Now, Foul Feeder, Kin Eater. She kills her own, just like Mother. Assassin, Poison Technique User, Thread User, Puppet User. Puppet User. Puppet, puppet User. Is that... Well, if she, I guess, um, our parallel mind of Kubokos parallel mind did tell her... She is not the highest in the food chain. Mother isn't. So I'm guessing she's the highest in the food chain. And the doll that we fought that we beat by submerging in water is controlled with the puppet user skill. You got commander. You got champion. You got lord. You got ancient divine beast ruler of gluttony. And of course, demon lord, which we knew from the from early on. Ancient divine beast. I wonder what that is. That's pretty cool. R and ruler of gluttony. That's pretty cool. And uh, commander, you know, champion is champion. My gosh. <laughs> I don't think you'll beat her. I don't think she even understands you. <laughs> well, maybe she can. She's a spider. Who knows? Maybe you can talk. What? Oh, wait, no, she's immortal. Okay. 
I'm laughing because I know she doesn't die. So um, I guess I can find a little bit funny. What am I doing? Da -da 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 what an episode of Spider. My gosh, so many. A lot of things were answered for us in terms of um, the confirmation that Kumarko is not Demon Lord and is a person now named Ariel. So uh, I'm just going to keep calling her a Demon Lord because I just got used to calling her Demon Lord. And technically in the timeline of Shlane, she is Demon Lord. So I'm not wrong, but Demon Lord Ariel. And uh, now because we I've confirmed, I guess it is the girl in the Demon Lord armies that was like wearing the white veil. That might be Kumako. Think if you think about it, if you think about it rationally, she's probably the girl in white who, you know, killed or supposedly killed Shlane's brother, who was the past hero. We just saw that Shlane's um, friend, Faye, was able to gain something called humanification. She was a big ass dragon and she turned into a human. Not fully, but human enough. A human type body, a humanoid body. So it wouldn't be too crazy for me for our spider girl, Kumiko, to suddenly also find out human humanification skill and then be able to hide her, you know, spidery things. We her little pinkish, as you can see in the top right, her little pinkish um, pigments here and there using a veil or just, you know, a dress. It might be on her size and we don't see. And she could be the girl in white. Or I'm completely wrong and <laughs> we have to theorize again. But that's what I love about the show, constantly theorizing. Hope you all enjoyed watching with me um again more theories in my head i'm asking so many questions a lot of them were answered but now i just got even more questions like who the heck is d d's one of his classmates who could he be and also where's the vampire chick because she was kind of cool <laughs> but overall that's it